everyone so this is her side outside towards today and for some reason I just wanted to try a puff ball so that's what I decided to do this morning and I actually I have not did the big chop on my hair yet I have not cut off my relaxed ends what I did was I took some small rollers like really really tiny rollers rollers and I rolled the ends of my hair these are the ones that I use and I rolled my hair with these um, to give the ends of my hair what a relaxed hair is it to give it the look that is not relaxed to blend in with the rest of my hair so I didn't define my curls or anything in my hair because if I did if I had to define my curls my hair would look just it wouldn't look right I put it that way so what I did was I took it and I rolled my hair up with the small rollers all the way to the end and then after it, it dried I picked it out with a pick and kind of finger combed it a little bit and this is the way that it came out this morning and the reason why it looks so big is because I picked it out and I actually have my hair in two ponytails you can't tell but I actually have two ponytails in my hair um, I sectioned it off from ear to ear and I put one ponytail here and then one in the top and I just combine them together um, afterwards if that makes sense to make it bigger so um, my hair is so thick I still have about uh, about two to three inches I think of relaxed hair well maybe four about four inches of relaxed hair still on the ends but the rest of my hair is just completely natural on um, what I use to slick my edges down with um, I use some edge control and I use um, some gorilla snot on top of it which I think I did a video on. If I didn't, I will. I'll do a video on it later on. And I just hide my hair down. And when I woke up this morning, this is how slick. And it, you can see how well it held. And I promise you, I have no relaxer in my hair at the top. None whatsoever. Um, so that's basically all I did. And I just added this little headband that I purchased at my local beauty supply store. And it has like these little pink flowers or roses or whatever. And it has rhinestones in it. Um, the outfit that I have on today, I'm this... Walla, it's like a watermelon pink maybe a bubblegum pink dress and I actually ordered this dress offline and I ordered a red one and this is what they sent me so as you can see this is not red but they claim this was red this was their red or whatever but it's not red as you can see which I wasn't I was upset because they sent me the wrong color but when I contacted them, it's a long story. But anyway, I ended up keeping the dress because it was cheaper to keep it. So I just went on and kept the dress and I won't order from them again. Um, I decided to put it on with silver today, which you see pictures of the dress at the end of this video. Um, I decided to put it on with silver. I put on a silver belt with it. And the jewelry that I decided to wear is also silver. Um, the bracelet I have on, my mom purchased for me. I don't know where she got it. And I like it because it's really chunky. It's like a big chain chunky uh, bracelet. The ring that I have on, um, my sister gave me this. I don't know where she got it either. <laughs> and on this hand, I just have my wedding ring. The earrings are just some regular silver hoop earrings that I had. Um, I think they might have been a free gift that I received from shopping from someone. I think they sent them, and I just decided to wear them today. The necklace I purchased online. And looking at it, it looked like it's a metal necklace. This necklace is actually lightweight, and it's actually plastic. Believe it or not, it doesn't look like it, but it's actually plastic. The shoes and purse that I'm taking today, I decided to wear silver shoes. These are the silver shoes that I decided to wear. You've seen these ones before, the silver sequence platform, peep toe shoes. And the purse that I'm taking is the large purse that I purchased to go with the shoes a while ago. Um, it didn't come together. I said that in one of the old videos. It didn't come together, but... I actually match this together and they go together perfectly. The heel is the same color as the strap in the bottom part of the purse. And I don't know the website I ordered it from, but I ordered it offline. That's all I know. So yeah, so that's basically what I'm wearing today. And I am loving my hair. I really am. I'm loving it. Because I can keep this up for about two weeks now. I don't have to worry about doing anything to my hair. All I have to do is just tie it up. My, my, actually, my hair has been like this already for about three days. Cause I did it like Thursday or something. I think it was Thursday when I did it, and it's been holding up pretty well. And I was actually surprised. My husband actually liked it. He was like, "Yeah, I like it." <laughs> I'm like, "Oh, okay." <laughs> so yeah, so this is definitely one of my go-to hairstyles when I don't feel like doing anything to my hair. This is what I would be doing. 
so that is basically it for everything um, I I'm sorry when I did when I washed my hair I forgot to do a video every time it's like when I wash my hair I do it at the spur of the moment I don't never know exactly when I'm gonna wash my hair I just said well let me go ahead and wash my hair today and when I wash my hair I always forget to take pictures do a video or whatever I always forget so I don't know what I'm gonna do to remind myself to do it but I want to show you the update and where I am where I am coming along how I'm coming along basically with my transition so I'm gonna try my best to do something something soon and plus I need to do an updated video on the products I'm using and everything too so I'm gonna try my best to get that done soon I'm gonna try 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 so that is basically it for everything let me know what you think and I will talk to you later YouTube till then take care